I have to show this video because this is a huge mistake I made. So this is my mandarin orange tree right here. My Satsuma mandarin that I bought like six months ago. And as you can see, the whole time there was a sucker right there growing up out of it. I cut off most of it yesterday, so I decided to leave this part to show y'all. So here's the root stock right here. Here's the graft of the Satsuma going right up here and then around here, up. This on the left side is the root stock, which I did a lot of research, and I think it's a rough lemon, so a very cold hardy lemon. So what I researched and found out is that in most cases when uh, these nurseries are getting root stock for uh, citrus trees, they'll get hardy root stock for low temperatures, which is the bitter orange is one of them. And I think that is it because look at the thorns. I didn't know why these thorns were so big and there's like no thorns on, my, on, on the orange leaves. I, I honestly thought it was the same thing, but you can see all these that I cut off right here are a different leaves than those leaves. Like these are trifoliate orange leaves where there's like three leaves on here. So honestly, for like months, I've let this thing sit up here and grow. These little trifoliate oranges. It put almost all its energy into these instead of my orange <laughs> my satsuma oranges so i'm a little mad at that but you live and you learn and as you research stuff and you pay closer attention to your garden you'll learn that so what i'm going to do actually because this is very good against deer and stuff and actually against people because look at these thorns i'm going to root these i'm going to um try to since they're so hardy, I, I bet they're super easy to root. So I'm going to try to save these as cuttings and use them. See if they take and probably like surround, put some around the area of my oranges and see what happens. But you can see how many cuttings I got. And that's why I was trying to figure out why these were yellow. Because these were yellow, but my bottom part of the plant was green, which was the Satsuma oranges. Those are green. These turn yellow. Apparently these are deciduous so they're gonna lose their leaves in the in the cold and then they're gonna come back so it's a weird that they're citrus and they lose their leaves but I guess that's what make them so cold hardy and that's why I'm gonna at least try to root them and keep a few of them but yeah I'm gonna cut off this right there leave this up because this is the root stock that I want this is the graft that I want coming off of here I don't want this because this is sucking up all the energy. So, yeah, you live and you learn. And thanks for watching the video. I'm out. Peace. Update on rooting these trifoliate orange or bitter orange trees. Um, those spikes or those thorns are very sharp and they will stick in your hand so easily. So, I would definitely suggest to cut all of them off. And while you're cutting them off, you should point it away from your body because. <laughs> It, I had one stick straight in my hand. Didn't even go that fast. It's just let me. I'm gonna try to grab one of these. I'll show you how sharp these things are. If you've never dealt with them, these things are like razor sharp. And they when they get in your hand, it's like they stick. It's like a mechanism that they have where it just will hold in your hand and stay there until you pull it out. It doesn't hurt to pull it out. It's just it definitely hurts when it's going in. Here's a bigger one right here. It won't focus on it, but believe me, they are very sharp. So, yeah, I'm, I'm going to continue to root these. So what I'm doing is taking my cuttings around a random amount of nodes and then just scraping it a little bit and adding it to the root hormone, which is right here. And then I'm adding it to my soil. They should be hardy enough to where I don't need any special kind of soil. We'll see. Don't really care if these live or die. I just hate to see them just be removed from my rootstock and not do anything with them. So let's just see if they live. Just a practice go.